All right, so another question. I'm really enjoying the questions that are coming in. It's really great to feel like I'm directly answering questions that are on your mind. So keep them coming in. So this one is about ice and heat. Do you apply ice? Do you apply heat? Do you do both, which is called contrast bathing? Um, it does depend on the injury, okay? So it was a very, very, very broad rule. We will apply ice to joint-based injuries and heat to muscle-based injuries, but not always. It does depend on the patient. Some people are really cold intolerant, like me. I really hate the cold, but if I've overstrained a joint, I'll always brave up, get a bag of frozen peas, wrap it in a tea towel, five minutes on the affected area. It's really, really great. And likewise, if I'm feeling a bit oh, through these muscles, microwave or wheatie bag, good 10, 20 minutes. Oh, it's gorgeous, it's just the best. I do prefer microwave or wheatie bags to hot water bottles because hot water bottles just stress me right out with the risk of burns. Um, and as most of you know, the microwave or wheatie bags that we sell here in clinic, 100%, 100% of what patients pay for those goes into charity so we don't make anything on that it's just my way of giving back um, a gorgeous lovely patient of mine and um, his wife makes them so you know it's all just fantastic so yes honestly it does depend on the injury sometimes we'll contrast bathe or advise patients to contrast bathe which for you ice for five minutes heat for 10 minutes and ice for five minutes after that that's quite good in complicated chronic injuries where we need to stir the pot a bit but what i'll do is i'll pop a little um link in the comment section um direct to the ice heat advice sheet that i email out to patients when they've been in to see me because it does give a lot more information of how to safely apply these therapies and as i say generally ice joints heat muscles but not always and if you're not sure what's what just ask me i'm really happy to help and advise i hope that clears that one up maybe just cause more confusion sorry if that's the case but do let me know take care